Wisconsin Lutheran College is involved in a marine research project in Grenada in collaboration with St. George's University and Dr. Claire Morell that you see here. Also, Dr. Rob Balza from our biology department and myself, Bob Anderson, lead students on this exciting project where we have the opportunity to scuba dive in the nearshore waters in the marine protected area near Grenada. We find extensive fish populations and wonderful sponges and soft corals as you see here. The project is designed to provide data for the Grenadian government to help in managing these areas. Every once in a while we see an exciting creature like this octopus, which didn't seem real happy that we had arrived on the scene. This project is funded by the Fisher family as well as Gary Stymack. The purpose of this project is to do transects in sections of the coral reef that will allow us to come back year after year in order to detect changes to see if the coral is, has been enhanced or if there are more problems. The, the students that get involved in this are typically biology majors, but there are also some students from art majors and business majors that have participated in this project. Every student is scuba certified and open water certified down in Grenada and they get to see exciting uh, fish and get involved in setting up these transects. They're set up permanently so that every year we can come back to the same spot and we have transects in the marine protected area and also outside the area. We video each of the transects in order to get an idea of uh, just visually what it looks like so that we can compare that from year to year. And you can see the large numbers of fish. These are brown chromas that you're seeing that are feeding on plankton in the water column. On this particular transect we counted uh, close to 3,000 brown chromas. We also take pictures every half meter along the 30 meter transect so we can do digital analysis of the transect. Here we see a reef squid which was very curious and wanted to find out what we were doing in his world. They tend to stay a certain distance away from us. We come across little communities of organisms and you can see the tremendous diversity that this ecosystem has. And then it's time to head back to the boat and along the way of course we take advantage of every opportunity to look at the, the detail of this amazing environment. The water temperatures are always right around 80 degrees and usually the water is fairly clear. This year there was quite a bit of algae in the water and so the water clarity wasn't all that great. And so then it's up to the boat we go and we always have to kind of wait in line in order to climb up the ladder where we get some help from our Dive Grenada crew.